Let's draw an ocean biome. Let's use a pencil to draw the foreground, middle ground, and background. In the foreground, let's draw a few objects. I'm going to start with a rock in the corner. In the other corner of our foreground, draw two more rocks. This time make them round. Above the first rock we drew, draw some long lines to be seaweed. In the other part of our foreground, let's draw some coral. In the middle of our paper, let's draw the middle ground. We're going to draw a straight line going behind all of our objects in the foreground. In the background, use a wiggly line to draw trenches. These look kind of like mountains, but they're underwater. Using a dark tool such as a black crayon, black marker, a sharpie, or black colored pencil, trace each of your pencil lines carefully to make them stand out. Then clear away any pencil marks with your eraser. Color your biome as neatly as you can. You could use any method that you want with any tools that you want. You could use markers, crayons, or color pencils. For today, I'm choosing to trace all of my shapes with marker first. Now I'm going to use crayons to color the inside. Remember, you don't have to do this technique to color your biome. You could choose whatever technique you wish to use. Now you need to take the animal you drew from your endangered species list, carefully cut and glue it onto your biome. Notice that I'm not cutting on the line, rather I'm cutting around my shape, kind of like it was a sticker. Now your biome's complete, you can add other critters as friends or stop here.